Well, good morning. We are finishing up on the Brinkley here. Uh, just double checking everything in the uh, bay here. Well, let's get that light on. There we go. Um, running a stress test right now. We'll show that on the flare here in a minute so we can just make sure that there's no hot spots showing up uh, in any of our connections. But so far, my uh, just quick field test, everything's looking pretty good. Um, I think we're going to forego adding additional solar to what's already on the roof. We're just going to make sure it's all hooked up and working correctly. Uh, here's what we're looking at, running about 150 amps. We're calibrating again some of the hot spots here, that inverter. Uh, in the grand scheme of things, the inverter is the hottest spot. And interestingly enough, the uh, servo over there on the left. We are getting kind of a concentration here. Let's see what we're at. I mean, all of 75 degrees. I'm feeling it here. It, I can't really feel much, but that's why I like to use this uh, FLIR system is it finds things that you can't feel or see. And uh, again, this, I'm really happy with the uh, with this new breaker system we're using, it just stays cool as a cu cucumber. Really liking that. All right, here it is, all cleaned up. Got our covers on, got a sticker. Got some uh, LED light strips, motion activated in there. Uh, there already are motion activated lights in here, but I think these look pretty cool. And uh, the only thing we really have left to do on the Bottom side here is I gotta secure those back up in there. If you're doing this, make sure you don't forget. It's easy. But uh, yeah, we've been running this for a while now, and uh, so far the connections are still staying cool. Are we actually? Are we still running 150 amps? Yes. Oh, all right. <laughs> yeah. Huh? Down about 85. Okay. Yeah, everything. this is probably about the hottest point right now, and it doesn't feel bad at all. Yeah. yeah. You could run that all day long. Not a problem. All right, uh, sorry I didn't record anything uh, while we were up there. Um, but... A uh, customer had these two parallel or these two uh, panels connected in series, and we just connected the other one in series. And they run at about 41 volts of VOC, so that's well under the 250 limit on the solar charger we have. So they're all wired in series now and good to go. I'm sure we'll give it a test here before this video is done. And it is a little bit cloudy, but we'll see what we see. Look at this little bear. Oh, and there's a Zuki here to check in on the project as it's done. So we got it outside, it's making great power, well over uh, 800 watts. Uh, so feeling good about that. The batteries are 100% full. Um, really happy with the way this project turned out. So I know it's a little shorter video this Saturday, but uh, just thought we'd wrap it up. So as you can see, the sun finally came out. So we're really feeling good about that. Um, had a Zephyr hockey game today. Last game of playoffs, we lost. So uh, we're out, but um, got a little bit more work to do. Got some other things to take care of around the shop. So I'm gonna get to that. Uh, probably won't see you until next week sometime. We're gonna be working on that uh, 24 volt giant uh, system on the Alliance fifth wheel. Can't wait to see you and I'm gonna share it with you. So until then, see you next time.